Hi, I'm Mickey from Columbus Metropolitan Library, and this is my friend Juliet. And today we brought a book to read with you. This is Pete the Cat. Can you guess what the letter of the day is? The letter of the day is P for P -P Pete. Let's try to write that in the sky together. Take your finger and we're gonna draw a P. It goes down and then there's a hump. That's P and it makes the P P P sound. In story time, we like to focus on ready for kindergarten skills. And today I'm focusing on letter recognition. So when you're at home, I want you to hunt for all of those P's. And I really like this book because not only does Pete start with P, but there's a lot of interjections in this book. There are a lot of fun to read and helps little ones see those letters on the page. Let's get started. Pete the Cat and His Four Groovy Buttons by Eric Litwin and art by James Dean. cat put on his favorite shirt with four colorful, big, round, groovy buttons. He loved his buttons so much he sang this song. Are you ready to sing with me? My buttons, my buttons, my four groovy buttons, my buttons, my buttons, my four groovy buttons. one of those big letter P's that are fun to look at in this book. Pop! Oh no! One of the buttons popped off and rolled away. How many buttons are left? Hmm. If you said three, you are right. One, two, three. But did Pete cry? Goodness no! Buttons come and buttons go. He kept singing his song. My buttons, my buttons, my three groovy buttons. My buttons, my buttons, my three groovy buttons. <gasps> Pop! There it is again. Do you see the letter P? Oh no. Another button popped off and rolled away. How many buttons are left, Juliet? Hmm. Two. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. Buttons come and buttons go. He kept on singing his song. My buttons, my buttons, my two groovy buttons. My buttons, my buttons, my two groovy buttons. <gasps> Pop! Where's the P? Two P's on this page. Oh no, another button popped off and rolled away. How many buttons are left? One. Did Pete cry? Goodness no, cause buttons come and buttons go. He kept on singing his song. My button, my button, my one groovy button. My button, my button, my one groovy button. I think you know what's gonna happen next. Pop! Did you say it with me that time? Let's do it again. Pop! Oh no. That last button popped off and it rolled away. How many buttons are left? Juliet, how many buttons does Pete have now? <sighs> Zero. He doesn't have any buttons left on his shirt. But did Pete cry? Goodness, no. Buttons come and buttons go. Pete looked down at his buttonless shirt, and what do you think he saw? His belly button! And he kept on singing his song. You want to sing it with me this time? My button, my button, still have my belly button. My button, my button, still have my belly button. You know what Pete says. It's all good, right? I guess it simply goes to show that stuff will come and stuff will go. But do we cry? Goodness, no. We just keep on singing our song. Buttons come and buttons go.
the end. Thanks for joining me today and for reading Pete the Cat with me and with Julia. She had a lot of fun too. See how many letter P's you can find in your house today. And be sure to keep checking back on our Facebook page, Columbus Library, for more virtual story times. I'll see you next time.